I would look and survey and I would see Rosenbaum um, standing there and I saw the plastic bags in his back pocket. Is there anything that he had said that evening that you took notice of or would remember? Yeah, that's the part I was kind of getting to is, okay. um, I know you guys call him Mr. Yellow Pants and that's kind of what we called him. He jumped up on the car and everybody started screaming, get off the car and Black Lives Matter was screaming and he was shouting and Rosenbaum started shouting back at us that he's going to, pardon me judge for saying this and everybody else, but he was going to kill us motherfuckers, motherfucking niggers and cut our hearts out. The gentleman on the screen there said that? Yes, okay. multiple times. What was your group's response to that, if any, when he said that? None. We just, you kind of are frozen at the verbiage and the threats coming out of him. I mean, the whole night was quite shocking, but we didn't really do anything. We just kind of stood there. You, you have to ignore that. Mr. Lukowski characterized him as a babbling idiot. Would you agree with that? I didn't hear him babbling. I just heard him, well, I don't know if babble's a good word, if I may, he was just bitching. He was a little guy, right? I, I, I thought he was like the same height I am, but... How tall are you? I'm well, five, four and a half. As I looked at him, I saw his arm go up and like something, like he lobbed something. And then within seconds, my eyes started watering, my nose started watering, I started coughing. Um, I, I didn't know what a chemical bomb was. I didn't know, all of a sudden I just heard guys screaming, chemical bomb, chemical bomb. And I just pulled my mask up. You brought along a 380 pistol? Yes. You were going to use that to protect property? And myself, yes. How were you going to use that pistol to protect property? Sometimes a presence speaks louder than a lot of things. The presence of what? The presence of having the gun and being there at the business. Were you openly carrying the gun? Yes, I was. So you didn't have it in a holster or in a I waistband? Did have it. Yeah, I'm sorry. It was on my side in a holster. But you figured if people saw that, they'd be scared off? Somewhat. Like I said, it's a presence. It's knowing that somebody's on the... On the um, in the area on the ground standing there. It's kind of a deterrent to keep them away from the business.